great ability as an athlete. He's leaping. He's diving. He's there. Some people think that's offensive to players. That he was a he was a great athlete. I don't think I've ever seen a quarterback who had as much basic physical talent as Randall Cunningham. You know, when I first saw Randall, our first minicamp, uh, you know, I thought this guy would be the greatest quarterback of all time. I really did. He had that kind of talent. We were in Buffalo, and I said, I know Bruce Smith is coming. At the split second I needed to, I ducked, and he went over me. I said, whoa. He ducks under three men. He's looking. He's rolling. He's heaving a deep downfield for Barnett, who leaps and has it at the 40. Barnett's going to score! Some of the things I did on the field, I don't know how I did them. If you wanted a highlight film every week of Randall Cunningham, you could have it. Win or lose, you could have it. And I think there was too many times he got caught up in that. In Randall Cunningham's second year, defensive guru buddy Ryan took over. But he didn't pay much attention to Randall's side of the ball. Buddy's order to Randall was run first, throw second. Here I am going through trying to learn plays, and then all of a sudden, Buddy Ryan comes in and is like, I want you to be faster than you even are now. And so he trained me like I was a racehorse. He developed me to be a running quarterback, not just a scrambling quarterback. He's going to run. He's going to run with the football. Now he's running. And we are looking at Rambling Randall once again. You know, the old philosophy, you keep somebody in the spy. But the spy guy couldn't catch him anyway. It was almost like he was made of rubber. The guy had a body like Gumby. The thing could bend in any direction. Faking, now rolling with the football and being flattened at the 10, but throwing the ball to for a touchdown. I don't know how he did it. I think we're looking at Plastic Man. You know, I could have had probably another 15 sacks on my career total if it wasn't for that doggone guy. Called me and they always say, Why do you think you can fly? I said, I'm an eagle. <laughs>